And I really, really do love these curtains. They are so pretty. The mirror, the, the material, the texture of this linen. Just so pretty. And bright. Okay, y'all. So the curtains are up. And I really, really, really like them. Really like them. I think the length is perfect. And um, it just give it a whole, just a clean look. And um, that's what I was looking for. Um, I am going to, like, open them up. You, like, tie them back or, or just open them up. So, um, because I like um, for my, you know, the sunlight to come through. But, um, yeah, I'm just opening wide open. Lift the blinds all the way up and just open it wide open. But for the most part, I really, really like the way they, they look. Perfect fit, perfect width. I'm glad it was four curtains in. Um, it was a four pack of uh, 38 width by 96 length. And um, really nice. So, yeah. All right, so that's it for those curtains. I just still have to get this mess up off of here now. So, all right. Good morning, YouTube family. Um, happy Friday. I'm sitting here with one eye open and one eye closed. I just um, came back from dropping my son off. It's a little bit at the 6 in the morning. And, um... So y'all, look, the reason why I'm on this early, um, with my nose itching, um, I was waiting on a package from Amazon yesterday, right? So, <clears throat> didn't see the, didn't see the package at all yesterday, and it said it was delivered. So I'm back in the driveway this morning. Y'all know on my porch, I have that black and white cushion on that bench. Why is my package on that porch? Blended in with it, you know, I'm just like, you know what? All night long, somebody could have came and got that. But I'm glad that I do have it. So I'm getting ready to open it up and share with you what I got. Okay. So let's start with this box right here. Okay, so these are the chair leg, uh, the chair protectors, the leg protectors. It's kind of dim in here. Let me see. Let me turn this light on. That's a little bit better. They're supposed to be the crystal clear leg co uh, covers. I mean, look, not leg covers, uh, protectors, y'all. Yep, so I got these. Y'all know I said I bought the little felt pads to go on my chairs. And every time I move them, it's like the sticky stuff was on the floor because they will move. And I was worried, worried about these because. You know, my legs are not that big, but hopefully they'll sit in there. And they have this on the bottom so that it'll slide easy. But, um, yeah. So, I'm going to share you. Like, my chairs, and you know, the legs are skinny. But this is what they sound like because they have so much grip. You know, and it's like, I'm over that. I'm over it, you know. So, I'm going to try and put, um... Take four of them out and put four of them on the chair and let's, let's see how um, if they'll fit and how they'll sound. Now, if these fit it, <laughs> they will be perfect. I'm zooming in so you can see them on there on the um, 
<laughs> legs. They are extremely large, which I was trying to find some that was smaller. Let me see if I can zoom out some so you can see. But they are huge. And every time I put one on the other one leg, I lift the other leg up, the other one will come off. So but gliding wise, if they will stay on, which I don't know because they're so big, you don't hear all that no more. You know. But I'm just so annoyed because I just keep spending my money on stuff and it's not working. I looked online at Home Depot before I ordered these off Amazon. And um, they had the same ones. The only ones I seen online that were fit for these was the little felt stickers. And like I said, I'm not buying that no more. I still have, have some, but it's like, like I said, they kept sliding off. And, um, you know, all the sticky stuff will be on the floor. So, look like that might be a fail, too. I don't know. I'm going to just keep those four on that one chair and just see how it'll work throughout the day. And then go from there with that. Let me go to my next package. Okay. So y'all know when you wear like um, strapless dresses or dresses with like spaghetti straps or, you know, your tank tops, it could be a t-shirt, you know, or a jumpsuit, you know, whatever that, that, you know, a dress that has cutouts, you know, etc. And, you know, we, we have the bras that like the new colors and different color bras with the clear straps and everything. But sometimes that just don't work out. You know, you don't want the bra showing at all, not even the straps. And so I know I don't try different type of pasties and stuff like that. But I was watching um, um, Kyra. What's her name? Kyra Amanique. Let me see. Make sure I got her name right. So I do watch her, but I'm trying to make sure I got her name right. Yeah. Kyra, Kyra Amanique. And um, she... Um, I'm trying to get pull up her pull up her page. Kyra. And anyways, she 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 went into um the store to go and to get her some nippies. And so when she went in to get her nippies, um the they call it nippy skin, she um Put them on in the car just to show you how easy they are and you can you you know reuse them um i said i'm going to get some of those because they look so natural and so what she did she went up a size because of the era oil oil you know bottom being larger she's went up a size so i did the same thing went up a size in the cup so i'm gonna turn this camera around and here are the nippies i gotta open the box Okay, so yeah, she bought hers from um from Nordstrom's, but I, I purchased mine online from Amazon, and um, yeah, they have the history on the back. Um, it tells you about the support tabs, um, skin safe. You know they come in a, in a matte finish, Invisapeel, but yeah, let's 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 open up the real deal. Was that I took them out of the box. So let's let's open up the real deal. Okay, so this is the little cute little box. It says B6 on there. Sam. Oops. Um you got your little um instructions on how to wear in there. It says to um clean and let me see. Clean and dry the skin. Remove from the tray and peel. And don't throw that away. Apply them. And um, it only take five seconds to apply them. So, anyways. They got the care instructions on the back of there also. And this um, 
these are not sponsored i purchased these myself like i said from uh instagram but it is from the nippy skin company so oh i hope they work y'all i hope they work i hope they work I hope, um, I'm going to keep mine in the box too, y'all, because I don't want them to dry out. But they do look natural, just like how she showed it on, um, on her, on her video. They look natural. They look silicone-y. And, um, you know, and I know when she put them on, she had on a white t-shirt. And you couldn't even tell that, you know, that she didn't have a bra on. And you couldn't see nipples or none of that. They, they really did cover up. So that's the reason why I got right online to order me some. And um, I'm going to tell you how much I paid for these. Okay, yeah. So I paid $18.97 for this um, set. And I think I'm going to really like them. I don't even want to pull back the um, wax paper. The play, you know, because they said keep that paper too. So you can stick them back on there. But yeah, I don't even want to pull that off. So I'm going to try these out. Um, the next time I wear something that's strapless or, um, you know, that I need to put it under instead of wearing a bra. Sometimes I even put on my comfortable bras and just push the straps in. But I'm going to see how this works. You know, I'm going to see. Okay, y'all, so um, I think I'm going to get my day started by making me a cup of tea and then sit here and drink my tea, get on the computer for a little bit. I turn the camera around. Yeah, um, I think I'm going to make me a, a cup of tea and then get on the computer for a little bit, get in the shower and just, uh, you know, start making it of a productive day. I do have a dentist appointment this morning too in a few hours so yeah I got time so I'm try to um, get some things accomplished around here before I do go to that y'all listen so yesterday I kept saying I need to go and get me some flowers to put out right for my um, my patio because I pretty much put what I was gonna put in my front because I don't know if I shared with y'all before the Sun just sits right in the front of my house so it you know has ruined a lot of flowers and plants but I, i'll normally move them from the front when they do that and i move them to the back and when i move them to the back you know i'll bring them back to life but um so the plants that i got this time that i hung up florals um they can stand the high heat so direct heat so i got two of those and then the other ones were ferns and i normally like to hang ferns all the way across the front of my house but over the years, I I, it's, I waste a lot of money doing that because the sun just burn them right out, no matter what I do. Um, but anyways, I said that to say this. I was going out to get my flowers twice yesterday. I was going to leave to go get flowers, and I'm glad I didn't because, well, we got a frost advisory. I mean, I, it's 38 degrees outside. I go outside, my grass is all white <laughs> with frost, and we got a frost advisory out until tomorrow tomorrow morning I'm like this is so crazy like I am over at Michigan <laughs> I'm over it all right y'all let me go make my tea oh one more thing y'all see what I got on I got my Calvin Klein coat on winter jacket winter coat actually that's how cold it is outside okay
Okay, YouTube family. So I'm back from my appointment and I also stopped at um, Myers and I picked up a few plants to put outside. So now I can do um, my patio, my patio reveal. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and share. Hey YouTube family, welcome back. Happy Monday y'all. Now I know I said uh, I had did the last haul and um, I said I was gonna kinda leave that open just in case I had purchased anything else. And I did. Um, I, I had a haul before that too. And I haven't even uh, <laughs> edited that video and put it in. I had forgot all about it when I went in the computer and I'm like, so I gotta go through and edit that, edit the other one unless I put it all together so um yeah so anyways y'all I'm getting ready to share with y'all what I purchased it's not much because I, I bought my grandkids a bunch uh, a few outfits a piece and so I'm not gonna even go through all of the kid clothes and stuff like that because I actually just put them back in the bag after um being on FaceTime showing them what I got well not the kids but showing them showing them what I got but um I'm gonna share with you what I got so, I, from Burlington, I purchased these um, bag clips. And um, they had some that was like neutral colors, like a um, like a mint green, sage green, gray, and white. And it had 30 in a pack for $6.99. And I was tossing back and forth with those and these. It's only 20 of these for, for $5.99. But the only reason why I went with these is because they're colorful. I just said, you know, everything ain't got to be, you know, straight and to the point like what I have. So I just thought these was cute, you know, put on the chips and stuff. I have some of these already, um, mainly in the teal color because y'all know that's my color. Still my favorite color regardless. But, um, yeah, so I got these. And then I also picked up a pair of these titanium um, flat irons by Talia. Thalia, Thalia, Talia, I think I know I always say her name wrong. I buy her clothes. And um, now I'm buying this. So I'll show you. The box is really cute. Right there, Thalia. Th Wait a minute. Thalia, Sodi. But yeah, so this is a picture of what the flat irons look like right here. And yes, they are, uh, these are the um, titaniums. They had some the pretty ones that was purple and they were um, ceramic. But I want to try the titaniums because I do have like the smaller, um, like half inch ones. And I have the, the next size up of titanium. I like them because the way they get hot and they curl your hair really good or flatten, straighten it out really good. So these were um, $19.99. And then I purchased this. Um, oh yeah, I got clothes coming out the back. I purchased this uh, blanket right here. It's just a cream color blanket. It was on clearance for $17.99 and it's by Catherine um, Malandrino, Malandrino. But I just got this oversized blanket, uh, fleece blanket. It feels so good. I purchased this because I so that when I'm, my grandkids are here and we're sitting in the living room because everything is white, um, I can set this on the, on the couch, you know, whatever. And then, um, you know, if somebody come over, company or whatever, and they got on fresh jeans, you know, the color, the black or the, or the blue, um, you know, I can just put this on the sofa so they can still feel comfortable. Yeah, and I don't have to worry about, even though I sprayed my sofa, you know, with the Scotch Guard, that, that ink still will, the dye still will come on the, um, on the fabric of the sofa. Because like I said, I don't have white, I don't went through white furniture, I don't went through uh, the cream color, uh, blue color. <coughs> Butte Clay sectional. That was so pretty um, that we had. And um, the sectional kind of broke into pieces almost like it would have could have been a playpen. But um, yeah, I, I really, really love that um, sectional that we had. And so like I said, just dealing with the light colors like that, I already know what to expect. I already know how it is. So just taking the extra precaution. I don't care how nobody feel when they come to my house. They can say what they want, but my rules are my rules. Um, so um one thing i forgot to get because i got the white rug in there i said i wanted the, the you know everybody to wear white socks i don't even want bare feet walking in there 
Okay, from um, the at home store, I purchased two of these canvas pictures right here. The reason why I got it sitting up like this is because this is how I plan on um, hanging it up, even though it goes this way on the wall because of how the tree is, the flowers are, and the stems. I want to hang mine this way because my mirror, I'm hanging it by my mirror. And uh, it's that's if I like it, the look of it. So I purchased two of those, $99 each. And then um, they do have a lot of their pictures on sale, but this wasn't one of them. And then I got this nine foot umbrella right here for my other patio. And I got this style because uh, it just matched what I had. They had some solid colors, but I just decided to go with this. Just in case I end up using these colors again, even with the black, the painted, um, you know, once I paint my deck and change the carpet and still go with these colors, I have this. It was on the regular $59.99. They're on sale. The 9 inch are on sale for um, $39.99 and the 7 inch are on sale for um, $29.99. So I still have to get a base and I'm going to find me a table. Look at the small little table that fits the umbrella. And I got this large umbrella so that it can fit over my whole, that whole little deck out there. Because the deck is like an 8 by 8 so this 9 footer will be just perfect. So I'm getting ready to try to just hang one of these up. I'm not going to take it out the plastic yet. It's not quite as wide as this picture. It's longer than this picture the way I'm hanging it. But not as wide. So I hope it look right. If not, I said I was going to DIY this picture right here. And uh, make it do what it do. Take the black out of it. Yeah, I didn't want to do that. Um, because I could use these in other places in my house. But if I have to, I'm going to DIY the black part and, um, you know, go from there with it. Because I really like the pictures that are, they had some that was just all white at um, home, home Goods at one point. And it just looked like it's just all like stucco on there, you know, and just then painted white over it. So, you know, I'll DIY the whole thing like that if I have to. I mean, you know, and it's in a frame. I couldn't find nothing that I liked at the at home store in a frame. So, I'm going to figure it out. I'll figure it out. And um, because I'm sick of this. I'm, I'm tired of this. This look right here. But I, like I said, I could use it somewhere else. Both of them. Because they're not bad looking pictures. But if I have to keep them, I'm going to have to DIY. Because I don't have black in here. And I, I, you know, I have the gray and the white and the gold. But I don't want to have to keep, you know, dealing with the, the black. So, let me try to um, hang up one and see what it looks like. Okay. So it's hanging up. Let me let me turn. I should turn the light on so you can actually see. Let me tell y'all. When I hung up those other pictures up, I think I did it just trying to see what it looked like off some nails that was probably already up there from the other stuff I had. When I moved that picture, look, I still got nails in the in the wall, y'all. And they was covered up. So <laughs> I'll make sure I take those out the wall. But let me see. Okay, so now you can kind of get a better look at it and so I know it would be pretty hung up the right way but I just thought these were so pretty because it kind of have like the the silver mirrory look and then um, like the little beads or rocks I'll say in there so I just got it sitting up here y'all up there right I'm gonna step back so I can kind of Get a better look at it. See if I'm liking it. I think it's plain. <laughs> it's something that'll have to grow on me because it don't have a frame on it. So I'm going to keep them for a few days and just see, you know, a day or two at least to see if I can, if it'll grow on me. If not, I'm going to take them back because. They really are overpriced. I didn't find anything at Burlington when I went in there. So if I find some at another one, then you know these may go back for real. They're really not worth $99 a piece. Honestly. Really not. Without a frame around them. But um, and they don't have no gold or nothing going through them. But you know, I do mix metals and different things and stuff like that. So you know, if I did decide to keep this, I can easily add some gold to it with, you know, a little paintbrush, a little acrylic paint. But they don't look bad by, like this. Um, but the gold would bring it out. <sighs> so, I don't know. I may take the plastic off one 
off this one just to see you get a better look at it um let me see okay so let me move in a little closer i don't know like i say very plain it's cute but i think the frame is what's missing off of here and it's it's not giving me like i don't know and then now look that's real rocks real rocks that's on the picture because they were falling off when i was taking them out the plastic so yeah i don't know but it's so pretty though so pretty but that frame makes a difference it really really does really really does so i don't know because I, I can't turn it the other way it's gonna hang off the wall and then my mirror is already you know rectangular and hung up like you know i don't want to have a picture like that around it. um you know it would have been different if it was circular or um you know or like it is right now just um or vertical hung up that way <sighs> I don't know. Whatever I do, I will share. So.